Today, I'll be doing the achievement, Defensive Driving, on the mission, The Escape. There are no powers, army unit selections, or Nova equipment to choose from at this time, because it is the first mission. Let's get started. Alright, the achievement's requirements are to complete the mission without allowing Nova to take any damage from the Warhawk. The Warhawk, I should clarify first, is the final boss of the driving stage of the mission. So there is absolutely nothing to worry about in this first part. You are free to just navigate through the facility, breaking necks and taking rifles. You can speed run it, you can take it slow, it does not matter. There is no timer to worry about. Yeah, you all go tell them what happened. Pick up the rifle. Focus your attacks on the ghosts because they are the detectors. Snipe from a long range. And that's about it uh, for the first part. Don't have to worry about anything. Once you get to the driving part, you are allowed to take damage from the other mobs. It's just the Warhawk. So when you're fighting the Vultures, the Banshees, just do it like normal. You only have to be really careful when you're fighting the Warhawk boss. Can I group everybody up? No, oh, not easily. There we go. Alright. I'm going to snipe the Cyclone. Easy peasy. Can I get by? Oh. Uh oh. Well spoken, Nova. There is a little bit of a timer associated with that. You don't want the place blowing up on you. And you watch out for the flame turrets. And the bad guys, of course. Get around here and we'll pick up this heel. And then head up to the other area. That's not the right area to go. I don't go down here. Ah, I went past it. It's not like I'm making a guide or anything. It just looks like I don't know where I'm going now. So get through the flame turrets. Stuff on the high ground. They can get damaged by the flame turret, too. So if you can organize it in a way that they will get hit, it's free damage. You can outrange the marauders pretty easily, or you can snipe them. Totally up to you. Snipe off the ghosts. A little too slow. The grenade can clean everything up. Totally fine. Whatever it takes. Where are the others? I didn't care about them, Stone. Just you and me. Wait, we're in 
I do not remember if you actually go save the other ghosts, do you get them to help you in the driving stage? I don't think so though. I think it's still just Nova and Stone, so there's no point. You can snipe down the easy to pick off targets, dodge the civilian vehicles. Again, there is nothing to worry about for the achievement until the Warhawk actually shows up, which is at the end of this part. Gotta make my way through these vultures. I want to say there's banshees that come too. Oh, Hellions too. One other thing to consider is getting this far into the mission when the achievement doesn't actually matter is making a save file. You might want to make a save file so that you can reload it in case you mess up. But I want to say there's also plenty of checkpoints that are done automatically. I've seen at least four pop up. So I'm not too concerned about it. If I have to reload, there's plenty of these automatic checkpoints. The real question will be, is there one when the boss comes down? When you actually start fighting the Warhawk? About halfway done. Still just picking everything off. Hey look, another checkpoint. Banshee time. With some very nice audio. Snipe is so good, so helpful for all of them. Get another heal. Doing fine. Again, you're allowed to take damage from these mobs for right now. No issues there, it's just the boss. Ran out of energy. Not ideal. And this is the Warhawk. So dodge everything. It's all avoidable damage. Do not get hit by the missile. Laser beam in a straight line, just don't be in front of him. Same missile pattern. Uh oh, banshees too. Just keep a watchful eye. He might do the laser again. Keep dodging the missiles. There's the laser. Oh god, that was close. And there we go. Don't believe I took any damage, so achievement should click. 
once the mission's over. Can skip this. There we go. Defensive driving obtained. Overall, not a tough achievement, but definitely annoying. A little tense. I don't believe you need to make a separate save file. I did see a checkpoint pop up right when the Warhawk came down. So you just focus on not taking any damage. Again, nothing matters until you get to the end with the Warhawk. You can take damage, take your time, whatever you want to do. Once you start fighting that Warhawk though, dodge the red circles, that's where the missiles are going, and then dodge the laser beam, which fires in a straight line in front of the Warhawk. So just look at which lane he's in and switch to the other lane. Be careful because that last laser did come a little quick, more, a little more quickly than I expected it to. I hope this was helpful or entertaining. Thank you for watching. Have a great day.